Hey friends, if the escape key is not working on your Windows 11 computer, then please watch this video. I will guide you through the resolutions. Now, the first solution is to check the keyboard on a different computer to isolate the cause with the hardware. I'll tell you why. Because the escape key not working has nothing to do with the function of the keyboard itself. Like if uh, someone said that uh, the num lock is not working or the number pad is not working, yes, there's a key to switch it off or the Wi-Fi is not working, then there's a key on the keyboard to switch it off or the function key is not working then we have function lock but the escape key it has nothing such so if the escape key is not working then please check the keyboard hardware by connecting that external keyboard to a different computer and if it works then uh, we will try with the rest of the troubleshooting so uh, the second solution is to update the keyboard drivers now how do we do this search for device manager in the window search bar and open the device manager window in the device manager window, expand the list for keyboard drivers, right click on HID keyboard driver and select update driver. Search automatically for drivers. The next solution is to update the Bluetooth and uh, USB drivers. So we'll go back to the device manager and then we'll update the key, uh, Bluetooth drivers. This one Intel wireless Bluetooth driver. And then scroll down and uh, you'll find the universal serial bus controllers right click and update all the usb root hub drivers the next solution is to turn off filter keys and other sort of keys so right click on the start button and select settings from the menu now go to the accessibility tab on the list on the left hand side in the right pane select keyboard and turn off the switch for sticky keys filter keys and toggle keys the last solution is a clean boot so Search for system configuration in the Windows search bar and open system configuration. Go to the services tab. Check the box associated with Hydral Microsoft services. If any of the box is checked, click on disable all, apply and then on OK and then finally restart your computer. Was this helpful? If yes, then please subscribe to the channel. And if not, then let us know in the comment section of this video on how we could help you further. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.